Hey guys, it's Lana, and today I am so happy to show you guys this custom LEGO creation. This is a custom LEGO semi with a what's called a detachable gooseneck flatbed trailer. And that's a mouthful, but it's because this is called a gooseneck because of how it's designed, and it's detachable. And this is of course not going to look as... there we go. Detachable. See, it comes right up. So, let's go ahead and let's take a closer look at everything. Is that even focusing? Okay, there we go. Now it's focused. <laughs> Sorry. Alright. This is the semi that I built here. A very simple semi, some design in Legos used before several times, I think. Except for I modded it in ways that I like. Just the bumper and different stuff, the detailing, the fuel tanks are a little different. It, it, it's a design, eventually I do need to replace this roof with a white, a blue, uh, no my gosh, I can't even get the color right, orange one. Oh yeah, the hood's a little bit different too, because I was running out of pieces, but they, actually it's kind of a cool look though, it's some little different. Grills, the front design some LEGO developed several years ago, first used on LEGO, the LEGO and the Toys R Us trucks from 2011. It was 2010, uh, 2010, I don't even remember. These steps would probably benefit from being orange and in dark blue gray, but when I get there one of these days, the mirrors are similar build, and that one got tacked in a little bit, some nuts. Oh yeah, you also have your side handling bars to get into the cab more easily. In the back there's a tow towing kit, which it's just brick build. I almost want to go sideways build. I don't know why I'm not experimenting this with a while. Got your hitch section, got some chains, got a shovel broom, there's bars over the window. So there's actually windows back in there, which is nice too. And it's just a really fun uh, truck too, overall. And you can push your rear and everything. So let's go let's take a look at the trailer. This thing just wants to roll off frame. Alright, that works. Good enough for me. To say that this trailer is long is an understatement. Taking it around corners and LEGO City base plates can be a bit of a pain. But it does work, and it of course works very well. In fact, really beneficially, it would be even it would benefit from being even longer than it is. But I'm not going to make a longer because that's pretty stupid. So as again, it has your detachable gooseneck front. That's just done. You can see there's four clips there. You can see up front the mechanism. There's just a bar on the bottom and then two clip click hinges on the top. So very strong connection to the bottom. A little bit weaker on the top, so it's very easy to designed so that way when it's carrying it, all the strength, instead of wanting to hinge like this and break inward, as of course actually no, the whole thing comes apart, it needs to do this. Instead of wanting to break like that, without a lot of force, I use the clip on the bottom and this prevents it from the clip from actually hinging. That's what my main design is. And so what's nice though is when I push down, it actually acts as a hinge point to break off the clip from the bottom instead of hinge just to lift off this top. It's actually a very simple design. So if I remove this, it's designed so that you have a very low entry point for stuff like street pavers and stuff on the front. There's also gates on the back, uh, just because I built it with that. You got your tail lights and everything on the back too, but you got gates in the back with little wheel covers and stuff. But it's meant for stuff like, you know, you get street pavers, asphalt pavers, they're very low to the ground. You need to have this lower entry point, so that's what this is basically for. It's just a really nice trailer. I'll keep on developing this, make it look nice. Oh my gosh, I can't stop destroying this thing, can I? So let's show that one bit you played on the front. Alright, well, let me go ahead and bring the truck back in. Well, arguably, you could say I feel like there's more to talk about about this, this custom creation. There really isn't. I mean, it, it's pretty straightforward. You see, it's what you see is what you get. I mean, it's not much hiding. It's really just details. You look at the viewer and say, oh, that's cool. Because if I go into detail about all this, I'll be here all day. I've done that in the past. People don't like it, so I'm not going to do it anymore. Oh, yeah, I guess you could say there's lights up here, too. And my light bar. Oh, that's amazing, right? I don't know. Anyways, though, <laughs> I guess that was... that's nitpicking detail. Anyways, though, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned and check out more of my videos and like and subscribe if you want to see more stuff like this and keep me going. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned because more videos are on the way very soon. Bye for now.